Hello everybody, a Random Gnome here, and today we are playing Fallout New Vegas, a really great game. And the reason we're playing this is because I asked, or my viewers anyway, uh, what they wanted to see played, and somebody said Fallout New Vegas, and also another friend came to me and said to me, you know, uh, I saw somebody recommended that, and I would like to see you play it too, so let's get, let's do this. I have not played this game for a while, but I have played it, so yeah. Let's go. It's probably going to show a cutscene, and if it does, I will mute my mic unless, you know, fuck it. I'll keep it on, because there's not really dialogue at all during this cutscene. But it's a really good piece of cinematography, if I say so myself. I'm pretty sure, like... It wasn't the same time, but it was kind of close. This game and uh, Mafia 2 came out, and they had the song in the trailer of that game, too, I think. So, I'm just going to point that out. My mic. Gotta get that suit, man. We're gonna get that suit. I'm telling you right now. War. War never changes. War. War has when changed. When atomic fire consumed the earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. As decades passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic, dedicated to old world values of democracy and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scored. Sorry about that. I ha I don't I don't want to make you guys sit through all that. So I for some reason thought there wouldn't be dialogue. I forgot after that scene, you know, it goes heads and explains everything to you. But, you know, if you want to see that, you can go ahead and find the video online. I just don't want to make the people who've actually played the game and just want to see me go through it, you know, sit and watch that. So, sorry about that. I just don't want to, you know, make people sit through that. And currently this game is unmodded, but hey, if we if we really get into the series and people like to watch it, I will definitely check out some of the mods that I am recommended or just get some. Because I know I've messed around with a few mods, like a, a mod where you're a hitman, and it's really cool. My name, I'll just make it uh, Gnome. And if I can, yes I can right now. Uh, I'm gonna set subtitles on. See, I don't get how, it, like, I understand why they'd put subtitles in here, but, um, you would think, oh, okay. You would think subtitles would be in audio, even though it's not audio, if you know what I mean. Yeah, you must be really good at needlework, because if you look at your own character's head, there's no scarring or anything. And yeah. So, what we're gonna do... We're gonna make him African-American. I'm not racist or anything. For some reason, I feel... In games that are realistic looking, like, realistic face, I think... Cowboy black guys are really cool to play as. Not racist. Or anything, because I'm definitely... I don't know, there's just something cool. Just look at this guy. You would not want to mess with him. Not not because who he is. I don't know, man. You just I can't explain it. 
I like to play as them. They're cool. Alright, he looks like he's ready for the wasteland. I'm not good at making characters. Not in this character creator anyway. Because you mess with one little thing and your character it looks like a morph. I think that's just the thing with Bethesda even though uh, Obsidian did this game. But I'm not sure. I don't know man. I'm not even going to mess with it. We're going to leave it like that. Facial hair, yeah we'll leave it. Yes, this will be my guy. Yeah, take me out of bed, old man. Doc Mitchell. Good. Why don't you walk down to the end of the room? Over by that bigger tester machine there. Take it slow now. It ain't a race. It's my first time playing the game with my new get capture card. I mean, what the heck, capture card, graphics card. And it's running at 60 frames, full. I know this game's not that graphically intensive, but it's just good to see your purchase was, you know, worth it. Obviously this game isn't, you know, the best looking or anything like that, but hey. Alright. I usually like my speed. Oh my fuck, man. Is this still recording? I hope so. Come on, tab back in. You can't be serious. You can't be serious. Hi guys, a random gnome here, and you probably just heard me like, hey, what the f- what? Is this recording? And because I clicked, I have a dual monitor set up, and whenever I was moving my mouse like this, it was on the other monitor, even though I'm in this game, and I clicked. And it clicked on a window, so it tabbed the game out, and I couldn't tab back in. But, I went ahead and disconnected the monitor, just so I don't have an issue with it. So yeah, sorry about that. Pl problematic issues coming on here. Yeah, we get it, Doc Adams. <laughs> Mitchell, sorry, what the hell. Alright, anyway. Let me just take a look. I do like endurance. I, my favorite is always agility. And that's because, I don't know, in games I like being fast. Uh, I do like science as well. God, I keep on trying to click on that. What else do I like? Speech and barter is pretty useful. I'll get one one strength up, and and that up as well, because accuracy and lock picking. I think those are pretty pretty necessary to have. I love uh, lock picking and hacking in this game. It's just fun. I don't know. I don't know if it's saved the display for the, uh, yeah, turned off my subtitles, which ain't that great of a thing. Audi also, yeah, uh, I don't want the voice up. It seems like the music is a lot louder than his voice, so we can go right there. Good. There we go. But that don't mean them bullets didn't leave you nuttered in a bighorn or drop it. What do you say you take a seat in my couch and we go through a couple of questions? See if your dogs are still barking. Ooh, you see how nasty this guy's feet look? Oh man. There's no Oh man, I wish I could get in there, but All it's right. kinda hard. Dog. Alright, he's asking me what I think when I hear dog. I'm gonna say newspaper. House Bulgar Bulgal what the hell? Burglarize. Jeez. What do you say? Treasure, whatever. Bandit. Stab light, dark, mother, caretaker. Uh, I'm gonna say, the question was, you know, violence ain't in my nature. I'm gonna say no opinion. I ain't. I'll say, no opinion. I'm always, f strongly disagree. I'm slowed. No opinion. I charge in to deal with my prop. Agree. Almost done here. I'm going to say, uh, two headed okay. ant. Okay. Last one, uh, alright, this is what I always don't get. 
Uh, I'm not sure if you guys are going to be able to see this, but I think this is pretty obvious that this should be in here. It looks like two weird looking people giving a high five. These are the hands meeting for the high five. These are their heads. This is their arms coming up. You see that? And this is their knee, like crouched down. Like this is their other leg, arm, and they're doing a high five. I think that every time I see it, but I'm going to go with bearded man. Okay. See, he's pretty smart on what I like, but not all the way. Uh, I'm gonna say science and just guns. Just Before because I, I like regular guns better than energy weapons. You feel out, just feel better to shoot. Let's get back at these toes. Like Those hands are pretty detailed. Got a family the veins. Shot in the head. Um. What's the good one? I'm pretty sure there's a really nice one in here. Ooh, Wild Wasteland. I might want to go with that. Fuck it. It doesn't really give me much of All right. I guess that about anything that's it. helpful to me, Come but me. I'll see you, you get to see crazy stuff. That's all that matters, right? Can't remember. Yeah, it's Z. That's how you pick stuff up. My sensitivity is a little bit off, but I can get used to that, I think. I don't care if there's dirty water in there, I'll take it all. You would think that Nuka Cola truck might be worth something, but it's not. Can always use this stuff. Ooh, a hat. Yeah, I know I want that. Got some of this laser pistol. See, ya. he doesn't even get mad that you take it. I don't know if he should get mad, but he just doesn't. But yeah, I think we're yeah. good to go. He's gonna ask if we're gonna want to do that hardcore mode, and definitely I don't. So if I'm going through that, it's just like it's nothing that's really insanely important to the story. So I don't want to waste your guys' time with that. But if you guys want me to, just comment if you guys want to sit through and look at all the crazy stuff. But here I am in my vault suit. It's going to tell me all this DLC because I got most of it. Just look how beautiful this game is. I'm probably going to upload this video in 720p because I have terrible upload speed and it'll probably barely get uploaded while I sleep. I'm in the process of trying to get a new internet service provider, but hey, we'll never know if that's going to happen. But this game looks so good. Like, goddamn. And also, my monitor was actually messed up. My graphics card made everything have little lines through it. I don't know if... I didn't know if it was a monitor or what. I thought it was a monitor. I was going to send it in for repair. But it was a graphics card. As I upgraded, it was fine. Look how big this thing is. Easy Pete's pretty crazy. He'll probably wreck me. I like this gun. But, uh, he's like, if you talk to him, or if you attack him, he's like, bastard. And he'll kick your ass. He's gotten a revolver. I don't know if he has it out. There he is, on his side. I'm gonna put the hat on, and then we can start actually getting things done. Apparel, okay. Pre-war. Uh, I'm gonna go with this. Did I pick this up? Or did I get this from... Probably from uh, one of the DLCs. Okay. Cheyenne, stay. Don't worry. Yeah, I guess there's a thing or two I could show you. Meet me outside. You got it, sister. learn how to shoot everybody as if we've never played a fallout before I mean well actually just the last fallout because the other ones you know weren't like this weren't third and first person now see the sarsaparilla bottles on the fence there take this and try to hit a couple of them but imagine like not having the aim that was added in New Vegas that's the right idea and just shooting like this sight. Geez, that's actually kind of loud. I don't know how loud it is on your guys' side because it, it seems like it's a lot lower on the video end, but it's really loud in my head because I'm using a headset. Well, that's a start. 
But I don't reckon you came to me to learn to fight Sasparilla. Uh, let's go ahead and do all the tutorial because I'm pretty sure I get more XP and uh, maybe some money. I don't know why she would give me money for that, but I think she might actually do that. I can't sprint in this game, can I? I just feel really slow. Oh, that's right, you put away your gun and you run faster. But it's not much faster. Ooh! Look at that booty. Look at that booty. Alright, let's, let's, let's get this done, come on. I might actually just murder everybody in the town after I do the... What are they called, like, powder puff gang or something? I don't know. There's this gang that comes in and kills a bunch of people and then you leave the town after that so maybe after that quest I'll just murder everybody. I think that's usually what I do. I just like doing that. It's fun. Jesus. They make you walk so slow for all that time there? just to kill some crappy little geckos. Come on, man. Okay, you're on. Go get them. Come on. <laughs> Am I really missing? There we go. Oh yeah, I forgot about vats, but I think it takes way too much time when you could just, you know, because sometimes they'll be like 40% chance, but if you do it yourself, it's like, see, you're getting... if you're good, you'll get it. Yeah, I think after this point she does all this stupid survival stuff that's really not so fun. Not really worth it, in my opinion. But hey, if you guys want to do that, go ahead in your playthrough and do it. But it's not the best. I'm pretty sure you just go to a little fire pit, do some dumb stuff. I really don't mess with this whole survival uh, skill tree. <laughs> I like like there's not a skill tree but I don't mess with that skill really you know it just helps yeah you see consumable items at campfires I've never messed with that other than the little tutorial thing I don't see the worth in it when you can just buy uh, stim packs or anything you need but hey I think if you're on that one maybe it's really meant for that hardcore thing it just now told me that that head was crippled Thank you. See, I just want to pop this motherfucker right in his face. Howdy. What can Easy Pete do for you? He actually might be the best character in this whole game. The machine? Harmless. Oh, he's talking about that uh, robot that's going around. I don't know where he went, but that's what he's talking about. So, yeah. I'm really not sure how... Okay. What do you want? Aw oh, man, I just did that. I meant to put away my gun, but I talked to him and just ruined the whole conversation. Well, you've been causing quite a stir. Glad I finally got to meet you. Welcome. I've been causing quite a stir and all I did was kill a couple geckos. Looks like our little town got itself dragged in the middle of something. About a week ago, this trader, Ringo, comes into town. We figured he was just in shock. He's hold You mean murder him? That's not our way. Even Some of the others like personally, I hope he sneaks out of town one night. All right. Yeah, powder gangers. What I say powder puff. Oh well. Let's uh go talk to him and I think that'll be the end of this first part cuz I really have no idea how long I've been recording and I don't want to put out a video that's so long that nobody's gonna care to watch. I know if I had a large enough fan base that that wouldn't be a problem, but hey, I don't have that large of a fan base, and I don't want to put out long, long videos that, you know, people are just sub to me f because of uh, maybe a Minecraft tutorial or a Terraria tutorial or something. They won't be that interested to watch a 30-minute video about some guy that they are barely even sub to for the reason That's of other videos enough. and tutorials. Who are you? What do you want with me? I don't watch uh, Naruto anymore, but if you guys have watched it, fun fact, this is the voice actor right here. 
the American voice actor, obviously. Sorry about the gun. You just caught me off guard. That's all. He's in a lot of games. Bad start. What say we start over with a friendly game of caravan? You know how to play? Yeah. He doesn't look very tough, though. I'll have a much bigger problem once his. What are you gonna do? I shouldn't ask that. I'm gonna lay low for. We just end up sharing the same grave if it's just the two. Start with. All right. He wants me to round up some people. Uh, let's see what we can scavenge. I think this might uh, give me a bonus in strength if I read that. But hey, everybody, thank you for watching. If you guys want to see another, well, I mean, I'm gonna make another part. But if you guys enjoyed this video, please like it. And uh, if you enjoyed this, you know, subscribe, and you'll be notified when another video comes out. And yeah, thank you guys for watching a whole bunch. Uh, check out my other videos or the next video that's going to come out. And yep, have a good day. Thank you for watching and see you guys later.